Hey folks, Nicholas Field here, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to access the transient designer that's built into Ableton's sample editor. Now, this is a really powerful tool if you're trying to work with drum breaks, and by the end of this tutorial, you'll see why. So, let's move over to Ableton here, and I'm just gonna show you the uh, drum break that I've already loaded in, in its pure form, okay? So as you can hear, it's a pretty thick and dirty Amen break. And what I wanna do is try to tame some of that. So what I'm gonna do is uh, go and look at the preserve area here. There's a drop down menu with two arrows facing opposite directions. And I wanna choose the first arrow that faces to the right. And next to that, we have the numerical value 100. If you click on it and move your mouse up and down, you can change that from between zero to 100. and this has a very, very big impact on the sound as I'm gonna show you right now. And once we get down to zero, we basically stripped away everything but the most essential transient information And there you have it. Basically a very powerful transient designer that's built into Ableton Live. Uh, hopefully this has been a useful tutorial for you. And if so, please press like on this video, subscribe to my channel for more content like this. I'm always creating uh, little tutorials and how-to videos for folks that are involved in music production, learning how to use Ableton, and are interested in sound and mixing more generally. So thank you very much for tuning in and we'll see you soon.